dear friends here we are going to discuss about the difference between the knocking phenomena in the case of si and ci engine <music> If you remember, we already discussed about the knocking or detonation tendency in the case of ESI engine as well as in the case of CI engine itself. So, how it will differ from each other or what are the differences between this particular knocking tendency here we are going to discuss. So, one by one we are going to understand the difference between the knocking tendency in the case of SI and CI engines. So the first difference is that in SI engines the detonation occurs near the end of combustion whereas the CI engine the detonation occurs near the start of combustion. If you remember the diagrams of that particular knocking or detonation in the case of SI engine that occurs near the end of combustion means in the case of SI engine the knocking tendency will happen when the combustion will be taken place or at the end of the combustion period. That time the knocking tendency taken place in the case of SI engine whereas the knocking will start to take place at the start of combustion only in the case of CI engine. So this is the basic difference between the knocking of SI and CI engine. The second one is that in detonation or the knocking of SI engine, this is of the homogeneous charge causing very high pressure rise and very high maximum pressure which create inside the engine cylinder. Whereas in the case of CI engine, the air and fuel mixture are imperfectly mixed and hence the rate of pressure rise is normally lower as compared to the charge in the SI engine. So this would be the second difference between the knocking of SI and CI. The third difference is that in CI engine the fuel is injected into the cylinder only at the end of compression stroke and there is no question of pre-ignition as in case of SI engine. Okay. So in the case of CI engine there is a chances of the pre-ignition but in the case of SI engine there is a no chances of any kind of a pre-ignition will happen. So this would be the third difference. So the fourth one that is in SI engine it is relatively easy to distinguish between the knocking and non-knocking operation but it is very difficult to identify in the case of CI engine. We can't identify if the engine is uh, producing knocking or not or if the engine is uh, working along with the knock or not. It is very much difficult to identify in the case of CI engine but easily we can distinguish it in the case of SI engine. So this is the another difference. The first one after this particular thing as we already discussed in the first difference the detonation occurs near the end of combustion and the knocking or detonation occurs in the case of uh, C engine at the start of combustion okay so this is again related with this uh, last one the factors that tend to reduce the detonation in SI engine and that same factor increase the knocking in a CI engine. So always remember dear friends, the components or the few factor which reduce the detonation or knocking in the SI engine. But definitely these particular factors or the components or the things which will increase the knocking in the case of CI engine. So these are the different things or the different factors or we can say the different differences between uh, the knocking phenomena in SI and CI engines. I hope you understood the things clearly with the help of uh, this. So thank you so much uh, uh, for watching this particular session.